In a world of when Lambo, crypto scams and fake projects, where can you find true value? No time to research cryptocurrency projects. No money for crypto reports that cost thousands and thousands of dollars. Don't feel defeated. Knockout Crypto Reports are the answer. Knockout Crypto Reports does the research, saving you time. Knockout Crypto Reports are affordable, saving you money. Knockout Crypto Reports only include the highest quality reports. If you want that Lambo, you need to learn how to invest in the highest quality projects early. Knockout Crypto Reports identifies the highest quality projects early, making you money and saving you time. Go to KnockoutCrypto.com and sign up for the report now. Thank you for following KnockoutCrypto.com. You can find us on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. Um, subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment below. Today's video is about the standard tokenization protocol. It's a decentralized network for the tokenization of any asset. Um, this, this coin, uh, this project has just won the Binance um, community vote round seven winner STP networks um, and has distributed rewards. Um, this, so we're going to do the video on it because it has won the Binance community vote. So Binance will list community coin vote round seven winner STPPT and has distributed rewards. The seventh round of the new community coin vote is now complete. Congratulations to the winner STPT on having the most votes. We would also like to thank the Iris for their participation. All users that voted for STPT will receive an airdrop of 154.01 STPT to their Binance accounts for each vote they cast. For example, if you cast 10 votes for STPT, you'll receive 1,540.17 STPT in rewards. All users that voted for Iris will receive an airdrop of 0 0.17 BNB to their Binance accounts for each vote they cast. For example, if you cast 10 votes for Iris, you'll receive 1.71 BNB in rewards. Distribution of the above airdrop rewards are now complete. Binance will list STP Network and Open Trading for STP and STP, STP BNB, STP TBTC, and STP USDT trading pairs at 2023 2 o'clock PM. Users can now depositing, start depositing STPT in pre preparation for trading. All right. All right. So that's the big news today. Binance will list the uh, STP. PT network. So what is the STP PT network, right? It's a standard tokenization protocol. Um, it's an open source standard defining how tokenizing assets are list issued and transferred while complying with all necessary regulations. Tokens built on top of the STP standard will use the protocol's on-chain validator to verify compliance with any jurisdiction or issue a specific requirements. Standard tokenization protocol allows assets to be tokenized in a way that makes them fully compliant across jurisdictions and transferable across any blockchain platform. I'm going to read that again. Standard tokenization protocol allows assets to be tokenized in a way that makes them fully compliant across jurisdictions and transferable across any blockchain platform. Um, they say they have over 40 plus project serves, 100k users engaged, 100 million invested, and 5 plus years of experience. Um, so the ecosystem includes issuers, asset owners use standard tokenization protocol to originate, structure, and execute the tokenization and syndication of their new offering. Institutions can leverage Block 72 for institutional sales and trading, institutional research, liquidity solutions, restructuring, and merchant, merchant bank services. Retail investors can use Block 72 mobile app investment platform for tokenization and asset management services. So the use cases for this project is compliant tokenization. Issuers can use standard tokenization protocol to execute the tokenization of their assets. STP on-chain compliance validator ensures global compliance at all times, giving issuers the best of all financing options, the liquidity of an IPO, and the speed and efficiency of an ICO, and the compliance assurances of a regulated offering. They also have a mobile platform. Retail investors will be able to access the new STP standard token offerings through the mobile app as well as wealth management tools for managing their STP standard token holdings. This single platform for all STP offerings will help individuals find and invest in the right projects for them while helping projects reach the right audience and grow their communities. There's also an on-chain launchpad. 
The STP token enables new financial tools such as on-chain crowdfunding where investors access new offerings by sending STP tokens directly to a smart contract which automatically returns the new STP standard token to the investor. Um, the core team is Mike Chen, Xing Han Li, and Richard Lee. The strategic partners, they have um, some uh, FBG Capital, um, Block VC, GBIC, Alphabet, NGC, and AlphaCoin Fund. That is some of the investors. They have a client network of some projects that you are already familiar with. Algorand, Basic Attention Token, Cromonia, Decentraland, Hedra Hashgraph, Zillica, Theta, Reserve, Ontology, Thundercore. Um, these are big name projects, okay? These are projects that you guys are already aware of. Um, I want to also bring up the Binance Research Report. Um, so, uh, STP standard, standard Tokenization Protocol Network aims to build a decentralized network designed to facilitate the discovery and the usage of digital assets across global communities. The STP standard defines how ownership of tokenized assets are generated, issued, sent, and received while complying with all necessary regu regulations. Currently, the STP PT token is the ERC-20 platform token that allows users to participate in events like airdrops, bounties, micro token offerings, and virtual staking. Additionally, STP PT can be used as a payment currency for services within the ecosystem. According to the original white paper, future plans for the STP network include enabling users to utilize the protocol on-chain compliance validated to verify compliance with relevant regulations such as KYC, AML, and accreditation, as well as any issue of specific requirements such as ownership, concentration, holding periods, and voting. The STP PT token will then allow holders to vote to elect the validator committee who will ensure that the compliance validators are enforcing the most up-to-date regulation legislation at all times. Um, the key metric as of March 23rd, 2020, the price was uh, two cents or 427 sats. Uh, current market cap was 17.38 million. 24 hour volume was 1.71 million. 30 day average volume was 1.17 million. Circulation supply is 687,660,639 coins, which is 35% of the total supply, which is 2 billion coins. All right. Uh, the project's website is uh, HTTPS, stpt.network. Um, so in February, 20, 20, February 2020, they announced a partnership with uh, Kobok, a Korean-based crypto community platform to jointly host airdrops, micro-token offerings, and bounty programs. February 2020, launch of virtual staking on blockzone.com. Um, October 2019, launch of the first micro-token offering on blockzone.com. Uh, December 2019 announced the launch of the STP ecosystem. So they're very new. Um, they've only been around, they launched the ecosystem December 2019. So that was only like maybe three months ago, because they're in March 2020. They did a Bitrix IEO sale conducted on June 11, 2019, which raised them about um, um, $750,000. Um, the Bitrix IEO sale was conducted in BTC only and raised a total of 94.5 BTC. They did two private sales as well. Um, so, and then you have the token release schedule. Um, so all of that is there. Their um, community growth, they have a Twitter with about 8.1K followers, Telegram with about 22K followers, and a, a Medium with about 5.0 followers. I wanted to show you guys, um, their, they have their white paper. Uh, they also have a Medium page. I wanted to show you one more thing. This is their Twitter page. Well, they have 10.9K followers on their Twitter page right now. Um, this project is one to watch because we know that security tokens and tokenization is going to be a big deal. I don't know how this is going to be different. Um, they got some competitors like Tezos, um, and they have some other competitors in that security token space. The tokenization of assets, uh, security tokens. Looks, uh, Polymath, I think, is in that space as well. Polymath, to uh, Tezos. There's a few competitors in that space, but I think Tezos is the biggest one. Um, I don't know how... Um, the, the difference is because um, I think Tezos is centralized when you have this one, the standard tokenization protocol was decentralized. So it'll be interesting to see how this works out. But um, they've won the Binance community vote. They will be listed on Binance today. Um, so I wanted to let, get that information out to you guys. Uh, so look out for STPT. Um, look out for them and, and, and what they're doing as a Binance community um, community award winner. All right. Um, I'm going to just pull up real quickly the uh, coin market cap on this coin.
I hope you guys are staying safe throughout this um this um uh, coronavirus thing that's going on right now. Like, I have a lot of people, you know, hope families are are staying safe and people are staying clean. Uh so it looks like standard tokenization protocol is down right now by about twenty one uh twenty one percent. Um, so, you know, sometimes when something's going to be listed on Binance, you'll get a run up in price. And as soon as it's going to be listed, people will sell it. The volume is $45 million. The market cap is $14 million, So it's a small micro cap. Um, but it's at two cents right now. There's a chance that it could be worth more later. But as you can see, you know, you had this huge run up because uh, in the past month, you had this huge run up from under a penny all the way up to about two and a half pennies on um, March 7th. So, and then it went down and it goes back up. So who knows what would happen with them being listed on Binance today. I'm assuming it will go up, but um, right now it's down 21%. So, but it had, had a huge run up. And as you can see here, the all-time high was um, $0.09 cents back on June 27, 2019. And it was at 5 tenths of a penny on September 30th, 2019. So it definitely took a hit down. Um, but adding to Binance should give it more liquidity. Um, right now it's on Upbit and Bitrix. So it does have uh, some legitimate exchanges that is on Upbit and Bitrix. Most of the volume is coming from Upbit and uh, Bitrix has a lot of the volume as well. So guys, thank you for following Knockout Crypto. You can find us on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. This is the standard tokenization protocol. Don't forget to join the Knockout Crypto report to get our inside information on what's coming next in crypto. KnockoutCrypto.com to get the next big crypto report, guys. Thank you for following the channel. Signing off. Stay safe out here during the coronavirus um, um, thing that we're going through right now. Stay safe. Practice social distancing. Thank you, guys. In a world of when Lambo crypto scams and fake projects, where can you find true value? No time to research cryptocurrency projects. No money for crypto reports that cost thousands and thousands of dollars. Don't feel defeated. Knockout Crypto Reports are the answer. Knockout Crypto Reports does the research, saving you time. Knockout Crypto Reports are affordable, saving you money. Knockout Crypto Reports only include the highest quality reports. If you want that Lambo, you need to learn how to invest in the highest quality projects early. Knockout Crypto Reports identifies the highest quality projects early, making you money and saving you time. Go to KnockoutCrypto.com and sign up for the report now.